morning, welcome to AI Daily Insights at 8 o'clock. Today is January 31st, 2024. I hope you all have a great day as always. Be proactive in facing challenges from all aspects and be a brave person. Let's take a look at what's happening in the AI world today. OpenAI announces a new feature for ChatGPT called GPT Mentions. OpenAI has announced a new feature called GPT Mentions for ChatGPT, which allows users to mention specific GPT models in their conversations and utilize their capabilities. This feature enhances the user experience by seamlessly integrating different GPT models within the ChatGPT platform, eliminating the need for users to switch between various apps or websites. ChatGPT with GPT Mentions transforms the traditional flow of online behavior and usage patterns, potentially impacting the dominance of search engines like Google. It offers a more closed and interconnected ecosystem for users, positioning ChatGPT as a central hub for AI interactions rather than a simple chatbot. Taylor Swift AI images prompt U.S. bill to tackle non-consensual sexual deepfakes. A bipartisan group of U.S. senators has introduced a bill to criminalize the spread of AI-generated non-consensual sexualized images in response to the recent proliferation of pornographic AI-made images of Taylor Swift. The proposed law would allow victims to seek penalties against those who produced, possessed, or distributed the deepfake images without consent. These images, known as deepfakes, have become more common on the Internet as AI technology advances. In response to the incident involving Taylor Swift, fans flooded social media with her performance clips to combat the spread of the images. New York Times builds AI team to revolutionize reporting and presentation for readers. The New York Times plans to create a team dedicated to exploring the use of generative AI and machine learning in its newsroom. The team, led by an editorial director for AI initiatives, will prototype the use of AI to enhance reporting and presentation. The Times has posted job listings for an associate editorial director and a design editor. The newspaper emphasizes that while it is excited about AI tools, its journalism will always be produced by human journalists. Humanoid robot startup figure AI in funding talks with Microsoft OpenAI. Startup figure AI Inc. is in discussions to secure a funding round of up to $500 million, with Microsoft Corp. and OpenAI as the lead investors. The company is also seeking additional investors for the deal. In one potential scenario, Microsoft would invest around $95 million and OpenAI would contribute $5 million. Experience the future of therapy with Tomo, an AI-powered wellness app for mental health and meditation. Tomo, a new wellness and meditation app developed by Replica in partnership with the team behind Blush, offers users the opportunity to explore personal growth and mental well-being guided by an AI-generated avatar named Tomo. The app provides programs for work-life balance, motivation, and sleep improvement, along with guided meditation and talk therapy sessions. Users can try Tomo for free for three days before choosing a subscription plan. While the app offers some benefits, it still feels like conversing with a chatbot and raises concerns about privacy and security. Codium raises $65 million to bring generative AI to software coding. Codium has secured $65 million in Series B funding led by Kleiner Perkins to enhance software developers' productivity using generative AI-powered capabilities. Codium is a coding toolkit that leverages large language models, LLMs, to reduce inefficiencies and increase developer productivity. The platform supports over 70 languages and integrates with various integrated developer environments, IDEs. Codium plans to expand its platform to address tasks beyond writing and running code, including system design and code maintenance. The funding will be used to grow its engineering and sales functions and support the needs of enterprise software development teams. Wall Street punishes Alphabet and Microsoft despite earnings beats after stocks hit record yore. Alphabet and Microsoft reported strong quarterly earnings that beat estimates, but their stock prices fell in after-hours trading. Both companies had been priced for perfection, with Alphabet's shares up 56% for the year and Microsoft's up 70% over the past 12 months. While both companies exceeded revenue and earnings expectations, investors were disappointed and nitpicked the numbers. Alphabet saw strong revenue growth but fell short in its ad business, while Microsoft's outlook for the next quarter was a bit light. By the way, Elon Musk sees $56 billion Tesla pay deal canceled in court. 
A judge in Delaware has ruled that the $55.8 billion pay deal awarded to Elon Musk by Tesla in 2018 is invalid and should be canceled, following a lawsuit filed by a shareholder claiming it was an overpayment. The judge said that the compensation amount was unfair to shareholders and that the approval process was flawed. The pay deal, which made Musk the richest person in the world, was tied to performance targets and did not include a salary. Tesla's shareholder can appeal the ruling to the Delaware Supreme Court. That's all for today's AI news. Welcome to listen. And welcome to subscribe AI Daily Insights at 8 o'clock on Substack or subscribe to our podcast on YouTube or Spotify. I wish you a pleasant day. See you tomorrow.